All right, the boys and girls. Hello, the boys and girls, and welcome back to this brand new video. And this is Canvas tutorial series. We're going to show you how to create images in Logos inside your Canvas. Have fun watching the video right now, and let's go. Oh, and actually, as you can see here, I'm in the main.js and I created some basic stuff like the canvas with height and some background color. And right now we're going to create some images and can create some logos inside our canvas. So first things first, we need to create a new class. And this class is named image for the beginning here right now. And actually, we're going to say, of course, this class need a constructor inside. And here inside the constructor, no, we don't need this. Um, we can just create the variables, for example, for, um, let's say, um, image path. Um, we just have something like x pos, y pos, width, and height. That's the thing we need to do for our image. And of course, we just can say this dot image path is equal to image path, and this dot x pos is equal to x pos and um, we need the, these things here as well to make those variables global here of course so it's and of course the hates all right so now we just can create an instance of our image class but now we need some more fun with the images and um, for this i'm going to create a function which is named create image and actually it's gonna take, create a new image inside our HTML canvas in the DOM of the HTML. So we're gonna say let my image is equal to document dot create um, element in this case. So we're gonna say create element, and of course we need to create the HTML element of image. And we can say my image dot source, which is actually attribute of the my image um, element, is equal to um, um, yeah, we need this as an argument, the image path. So we're gonna say here image path right now. And of course we're gonna say my image dot on load. Actually we need to do a function after the image is loaded. And the function is easily that we gonna, we need the, by the way, we need the context here as well of the canvas. The context of the canvas is what we specified in the beginning of the file. And we're just gonna say context dot um, draw image, which is actually the um, the canvas function for that. And here we need to say we need my image element here, which we created here. And of course we need some um, x pos y pos width and height. So we're gonna name this x pos y pos width and height. And of course we need that arguments inside the uh, constructor of the function so to say and yeah actually that's what we need to do here all right of course to make those variables um, not hard-coded we need to create a class of our image uh, object of our class image sorry and we need to say let's image is equal to a new image and of course we need to take this five those five arguments so we need to say logo.png and you wonder why I would take logo.png. I prepared here my logo of the YouTube channel as an image you're gonna include. And of course, we need something like uh, x pos, y pos, width, and height. Okay, so you will not see something here right now, of course, because we need to uh, create the, uh, the image here. Uh, that's what we need to call the function here. And what we need to do is to take the context first. Um, after that, we need the um, image dot image path, image path, and after that we need the image dot x pos, and then the image dot y pos, image dot um, width, and at least the image dot height. All right, if we save this now, you will see we got an image here inside our canvas, and especially this is a normal element like an arc. In, in circle or like a square it's just an image and of course you can um, make it bigger for example here 
and you can change the coordinates here for example and yeah you can do whatever you want with that image so i hope you guys like this video if you liked the video please give me a thumbs up if you want to see more subscribe to my youtube channel i'm banana coding see you in the next video bye